Instant Noodle Recipe Time is the best show in the entire universe and has made it a better, more enjoyable place. Well done. All right, hey, this is Hans the Ramenator coming at you with another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time. This is the show where I show you what to do with your instant noodle. Today we all got one that uh, came out of his, uh, an Umai crate. Go to japancrate.com. Use the coupon code the Ramen Raider. Get yourself a discount. Hey, it's uh, it's called Kishi Men. It's got water on it. Why did it get water on it? I don't know. Water on it. But uh, yeah. How? Be you. I be well. Two. I think. But uh, yeah, we're gonna make some kishi men. So it's like a flat, broad udon kind of thing. Actually, I had a dry version the other day. My only real complaint with uh, Umai crates are the way that they, uh, due to the descriptions of what's in there, because they've been calling four different varieties from this company. By the way, the kit company is called Kishi Men. The product is called Kishi Men. It's like, yeah, but Kishi Men what? There's like boiled and stirred, there's this and that, all, all these weird versions of it, but they're good, but I'm always looking for correct translations, I'm not looking for phonetics, I'm just looking for the right name, it, you can do it, <laughs> generally Japanese varieties aren't too hard to uh, translate, Chinese and Korean, that's another story, folks. I love it when people are like, oh, well, Google can do it. It's like, <laughs> yeah, I've, I've seen translations of instant noodles uh, from, like, simplified Chinese into English talking about dolphin bones and bubble faces, so it's, it's, it's really silly. But, that's what you get. Thanks, Google. I generally do enjoy Google. What I do enjoy is that I figured out... Oh, oh, breaking news. I've been getting a lot of breaking news on my phone lately. Today's big news is that uh, the Attorney General from New York or whatever had Trump do a deposition and he pled the fifth on every single thing. Like... That's such a cop-out, dude. Wow. I don't want to say this. It might incriminate me. Well, if it might incriminate... It's such a screwed-up thing. The fifth... It's like, you don't have to say something that might get you in trouble. But aren't you there because, oh, I don't know, you're kind of in trouble already? I just don't get it. I don't know. I'm no lawyer. I simply make noodles and talk about what I think. And sometimes I talk like this. And sometimes I talk like this. And sometimes, sometimes. But anyway. Yeah, we're supposed to possibly have uh, thunderstorms today. I'm really, really hoping. I really like, uh, I really like thunder and lightning. I, I told the kids about it. They're kind of like, oh, well, is Mama gonna be here? No, she's gonna be at work. Oh, will she be okay? It's like, yes. <laughs> she doesn't work outdoors. She works indoors. Yeah, the other one of these was a soup, or a, a dry, and this one's a soup. So here is our Kishi Manoodle. Can I say that? Is that okay? 
They kind of look like egg noodles. Kind of that, like a wide egg noodle. Certainly are hot. Not bad. We also have a Benito flake that came with it, but I wanted to try this based out like this first. Light, salty. We will put the Bonito flake on it in the this stage of the game, and then we will see what we see. Here's our uh, I kind of gave up if you haven't noticed on previous episodes about centering this thing because it's just such a pain in the butt but I'm gonna make a renewed attempt to center things correctly. I'm gonna put some Benito Flake on top. Yeah, get that nice fishiness. Look at what it does. Isn't that crazy? It just goes. <laughs> That's trippy. Just the steam. Look at it. It just like moves. No, I'm melting. Melting. I like that. <laughs> Have a little taste. Just, just want a little. And some squishy kishy man. <laughs> yeah. Benito flake, fish floss, call it what you want. That's chicken. That doesn't belong. But uh, I went to the store because I was out of spring onion, and that's that's a bad thing. And they ha only had like this immense spring onion. So that's what we get today. I don't think we need to do much more than that, do you? Very simple, basic. It's not bad. It's a uh, very traditional kind of thing. I like it, and I hope you will too. Um, so let's do a little rotato fun, 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 fun time. Here we go. stuff over at uh, japancrate.com use the coupon code the ramen raider for a discount but now we got something that I found over at uh, Buhan Market over in beautiful sunny International District downtown Edmonds Washington this is Jonga and their uh, hot and spicy noodle from South Korea definitely 
packaged for the U.S. market. So that'll be the next episode on Instant Noodle Recipe Time. This has been Hans the Ramen Reader wishing you enjoyment of your noodles each and every day. Like, subscribe, notification bell, um, trace your key, uh, send lots of money. Have a good one. Bye. Thank you.